Hi everyone. Thanks for joining me today. Today we will practice a gentle stretch plus a yoga nidra practice. In the first half hour, we will do some gentle stretch for the whole body relaxation. In the second half hour, we will jump into yoga nidra. Yoga nidra is known as yogic sleep. It will guide you into a deep relaxation. From here, come to a comfortable seat. Prepare your uh, props if you need and prepare a blanket that will keep you warm in the yoga nidra practice. When you're ready, you may sit on a block or you may sit cross leg in an easy seat. Take a moment to arrive on your mat. Let's begin our practice. Notice your breath. Start noticing your breath without judgment. Keep your breath at your own pace. Rest your palms on the thigh. Maybe close your eyes. Notice your inhale. Bring your shoulders stack on the hips. Exhale, ground your seat bones on the ground. Inhale, relax the shoulders. Relax the arms. Relax the gaze. Exhale from the deepest bottom of your sacrum. Exhale through the nose. Take a few more breaths, maybe deeper, maybe breathe deeper into the lungs. Notice where is your mind? What are you thinking? Use your breath to bring your mind back on the mat. And a deep inhale. Exhale, sigh without ha. And let's start do some movement on our upper body. You may uncross your legs and switch the other legs uh, at, in the front. Adjust your seat. You do some neck circle first. Relax your upper body, relax the shoulders. Draw some big circles from your neck from clockwise, bring it up and to the back, to the right, and to the front. Few rounds at your pace, you don't have to rush it. You may stay where you're feeling the tension. And come back to center, switch side to the, uh, the other direction. Sense what's the different feeling in the front and back of neck. The different sensation of the right and the left shoulder. 
What are you feeling today? Can you release the tension? Can you breathe into the tension and slowly come back to center? And then do some shoulder rolls. Bring your arm up, bring, bring your palms to your shoulder. Draw some big circles from your shoulders with your elbows. Reduce the, to the front. Up. Inhale and open. Exhale, lower. Inhale, bring your arms up, elbows up, point to the sky, open to the side. And exhale, bring the shoulder blades together, point backward of the elbows and come back. Inhale, draw the elbows up and back. And exhale, inhale up and exhale lower. One more time, inhale up and lower. Switch the direction to the back, inhale up to the front, maybe bring the uh, elbows together in the front and relax, exhale, inhale, open the chest, open the heart, and bring together, exhale, inhale, up, exhale, lower, two more times, inhale, bring the Elbows back and up. Exhale, wings to touch and to lower. Last time, inhale and exhale. Ground your ground your left palm left palm on the on the mat next to the uh, out, uh, other thigh. Inhale, bring your right arm up. Lengthen the spine, lengthen in the arm, right arm, and exhale, bend into the left. Breathe into the right side body. Breathe into the right lung. Maybe gaze up. Keep breathing in and out. Bend into the left. Inhale, bring yourself up and to in the center, palm your right, palm your right, right, right hand on the on the mat. Extend the left arm up. Inhale, lengthen in the spine, lengthen the neck and arm. Exhale, bend into the right. Feel the extension in the left body. Breathe in to the left lung. Reaching the left fingertips to the right, maybe gaze up or gaze down. One more breath. And inhale, push yourself back to center. Come into tabletop with your shoulder stack over the, the wrists and your hip over the ankles, relax the feet on the ground. You may bring some movement in your tabletop, to back and forth, maybe to the left, to the right. Gentle, stretch your body, bring some movement at your own pace anywhere that feels good in your body and come to stillness and come into a cat cow from the from your uh, flat back inhale open the chest to the front to cat cow at the, the cat at the cow pose Exhale, round the back, look at the navel to cat pose, push the floor away. Inhale, round from the spine, open the chest and open the heart to cow pose. Exhale, to cat pose, keep pushing away. 
from the floor. Few more rounds at your own pace. Inhale to cow pose. Open the chest, heart shining forward. Exhale to cow pose, to cat pose. Inhale up to cow. Open the throat to the front. Exhale to cat pose. Last time, inhale to cow. Open the chest and exhale. Gaze to navel, cat pose. And inhale, slowly come back to center. From the from the tabletop pose, let's come into thread the needle. Plant your plant your left plant your left arm on the ground. Bring the right arm up, open to the right, and exhale. Ground your right shoulder uh, under <laughs> on the on the mat. Extend the right arm to the left side. Maybe your temple on the mat. You may stay here, or maybe bring the left left hand on the hip. Open the chest to the left side. Feel the spinal twisting to the left, or maybe bring the left arm up. Keep breathing here. Keep breathing and twist to the left. Relax the facial muscles. Slowly and gently push from the left hand. Come back and open. Turn the twist to the right. And relax the right palm on the mat. Come into the other side, your left arm open to the left and plant your shoulder, left shoulder on the mat, extend the left arm to the right. Maybe stay here, maybe push your upper body twist to the right, open the chest to the right. Maybe right arm up, extend to the sky. Keep breathing and keep the chest open to the right side. And slowly plant the right arm, uh, plant the right hand and push yourself back and up, open to the left, twist to the left, counter twist. And come back to tabletop. Bring your big toes to touch. Sit on the hip. Uh, sit that your hip sits on the heels. Extend the arms long. And rest the forehead on the mat. Come into child's pose. Options for the knees, knees together or knees wide. Make the pose fit to your body. And come back to tabletop. And we will come into a gate pose. When you come into kneeling, extend the left leg long to the to the side. Left hand on the left side, extend the right arm up, bend into the left. Extend the right side body. Extend the right side from the right fingertips to the right angle. Feel the extension 
of the rays to the lungs, to the ribs, and come back to center. Switch the other side. Bring the right leg extend and come up for gate pose. You may tap the toes or uh, keep the foot flat on the ground. Come to the left side, extend the left arm up and exhale, release side bend into the right side. Maybe extend, keep reaching the right hand towards the right foot. Breathe in to the left body. And inhale, come back to center, release. And we come into a low lunge. From your tabletop, bring the right, uh, bring the left foot to the front, inside or outside. Uh, inside the the front, the the hands. Walk your walk your back leg to the back. Bring the foot on the on the ground. Come up to low lunge. Keep sinking your hips to the ground. Maybe use the blocks to support you. Notice your uh, notice your knees maybe stacking over the ankles. Keep your hip square to the front. From here, walk your hips, uh, move your hips to the back. Come into half split. Maybe walk with your blocks. Maybe hands on the mat. Engage, uh, flex your front foot. Engage the front leg. Maybe reach the arms forward to fold further. Keep breathing. Two more breaths. And then slowly walk back. Bring your blocks or hands on the mat. Walk back to low lunge. From the low lunge, plant your plant your right hand on the on the mat or on the block a lower level of the block. Kick your right kick your right kick your right foot up. Grab your right foot for a quadricep stretch. Choose your height of block. Maybe use the lowest, maybe hands on the floor, maybe a higher height. Open the chest to the left. And gently release with control. And from here, bring your hands on the mat like a tabletop pose. Bring your left, bring your left leg out. Extend the left leg. Sit back to your heels for a wide leg, uh, wide leg child's pose. You don't have seats on the heels, but keep pulling your upper body, keep pushing your upper body towards the heels. Feel the extension in your left leg. And release. Come into uh, touch your right, touch your touch your right feet, and come up for 
downward dog. Adjust your downward dog. Extend the shoulders. Lift the hips. Maybe extend the legs. Maybe bend into the knees. Keep reaching the heels down on the mat. If you can't reach the heels on the mat, just have that feeling to, to ground your heels on the mat. Extend the shoulders. All fingers and knuckles on the mat. And come back to a child's pose. Your options of child's pose again. Arms forward or arms backward. Two breaths here. And slowly come back to a tabletop. And this time bring your come into a pigeon pose. Bring your right uh, bring your left leg forward to behind your left wrist. Bring the shin parallel or slightly uh, behind the right the right hand walk your back leg to the back come into your pigeon pose if your hip is lift bring your block to support you turn your chest and hip facing towards the front of the mat you may stay in pigeon or lower to the front for a sleeping pigeon. Come on to your elbows or maybe rest the forehead on the palms. Two breaths here. Keep breathing. In through the nose and breathe out through the nose. Remove the block if you got any. Bring your palms back and tuck the back toe, come back to a downward facing dog. Again, you may walk your heels, bend into the left knee, into the right knee. Take some time to relax into the downward facing dog. From the downward facing dog, bring your right, bring your right leg to the front, inside the inside the, 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 the hands and lower to low lunge yeah. low lunge come up from your low lunge use the block maybe support yourself with the with the arms the front knee to over the ankle lower your hips towards the ground let the gravity do the thing and sink your hips to the ground. Keep breathing and walk backward into a half split. The hip is sagging over the back leg, uh, the back knee. Flex your front leg, feel the extension and feel the muscle engagement into in in your front leg. Lengthening the spine, maybe walk the hands forward, maybe stay, maybe walk backward. Walk 
one more breath. Keep extending in the legs and walk back to your low lunge. Plant your right hand and open your uh, plant your left hand and open the right hand to the, the twist to the right. Kick your left foot up, maybe use a strap. Come into a quadricep stretch. If it's too intense, release and stay in your low lunge. And release. Plant your both hands and ready for to, to come back to a downward dog. Turn the back feet come into a downward facing dog. Bring your right leg to the front for pigeon. Right shin to the front, right foot to the front. Behind the waist. Check in and walk walk your left leg back. Take a few breaths here. Open the chest to the front, the hips to the front. And stay or lower on your elbows, maybe on the blocks, or maybe rest your forehead on the palms. Two breaths in your pigeon. And release. Remove your palms. Bring the palms to the mat. Tap the back toe. Come back to a downward dog. Extend the shoulders, extend the back leg, and slowly release on the seat. When you're ready, come to and lay down on a supine twist, and lay down on your back. Bring your props or blocks with if you options for supine trees. You may cross the legs and we will twist to the left first. You may cross the right leg over the left leg. Maybe Bring the knees parallel to each other. Bring the legs together. Options for you. When you're ready, with control, lower your legs to the left. And open your right hand to the right. Come into a D-shaped twist. You may uh, place a block underneath the knees, if it's in the air. Gaze to the right or to the sky. And release, come back to center, bring the legs up. Keep the cross leg. Pull the ankles to the out, other side into a shoelace or eagle legs. Keep pulling the ankles and feet towards the mat. Gentle stretch on the hips and thighs within your control. And release, switch it 
we switch to the other side. The left leg on top if you are crossing the leg. You may uh, bind the feet if you need. And in control, drop the legs to the right side. Open the arms, open the arms to the left side. Maybe bring a block to support the knees. Gaze to the left or to the sky. One more breath. And inhale, come back to center. Grab your feet and or your ankles to the other side. Pull the ankles towards the mat. And release. When you uh, when you're back on the mat, come into a happy baby. Bring your knees to your chest. Maybe give yourself a hug. Rock it side to side. And come into a happy baby. Bring grab your soul with your hands. Pull the knees towards, towards the mat. Maybe bring the happy, uh, bring the baby to happy. Rock it side to side. Massage the spine. And slowly release. Again, give yourself a big hug. Hug the knees to the chest. Bring all the limbs, bring yourself into a little bean. Bring your neck, bring your chin to the knee. And release to Shavasana. Extend the legs. Extend your arms, relax the neck. Maybe close the eyes. Maybe bring the blanket around you. Maybe pull over the blanket. Stay in your Shavasana or come into a comfortable seat. Get ready for Yoga Nidra. Take a moment to adjust yourself. Adjust the body for 10% more comfortable. You may close your eyes. During the practice of Yoga Nidra, please stay awake in stillness without movements. You only have to follow my voice. When you're ready, take a deep breath in and sigh it out. Ha. Ah. Repeat, affirm to yourself in silence. I am practicing yoga nidra. I am practicing yoga nidra. I will not sleep. I will stay awake. Become aware of your body is relaxed on the mat. Aware your body, your mind are calm and relaxed. Bring the awareness to the head, to the face, to the neck. They are calm and ease. 
Bring the awareness to the upper chest, lower chest, to the abdomen. The front body is relaxed. Bring the awareness to the shoulders, the left shoulder, the right shoulder, the upper back, lower back. The back body is relaxed. Bring the awareness to the left leg. Relax. Bring the awareness to the right leg. Relax. Become aware of your whole body is relaxing completely. Become aware of your whole body is relaxing completely. The practice of yoga nidra now begin. It's time to state your resolve or intention. State a simple resolve in your mind. It can be a short-term resolve. Or it can be a long, consistent intention. Take a moment to get to your resolve. Plant the resolve deep inside your mind. Once the resolve is decided. Do not change it. The resolve will come true if the soil is perfect. Now, repeat your resolve mentally three times. Now bring the awareness to the parts of the body. Follow my voice and move the consciousness part to part quickly. You don't have to stay the awareness on one part; just jump it part to part. We will start in the right side. Bring the awareness of. The right hand thumb, second finger, third finger, fourth finger, fifth finger, the right side palm, the back of the hand, right wrist, right forearm, right elbow, the upper arm, right shoulder, raised. Right hip, right thigh, right knee, right calf muscles, right ankle, right heel, sole, top of the feet, right toes. One, two, three, four, five. Bring the awareness. To the right, left hand thumb, second finger, third finger, fourth finger, fifth finger, left palm, back of the hand, left wrist, the left forearm, left elbow, upper arm, left shoulder, left wrist. Left hip, left thigh, left knee, calf muscles, the left ankle, the left heel, so the top of the feet, the left sho left toes. One, two, three, four, five. Go to the top of the head. 
the forehead, right eyebrow, left eyebrow, the space between the eyebrows, the right eye, left eye, right cheek, left cheek, the right ear, left ear, nose, tip of the nose, upper lips, bottom lips, the jaw, the throat, collarbone, the right chest, left chest, middle of the chest, the upper abdomen, navel, lower abdomen, the front of the right thigh, front of the left thigh, right kneecap, left kneecap, right ankle, left ankle, the right foot, and left foot, back of the feet, right heel, left heel, right calf, left calf, right hamstring, left hamstring, right glutes, left glutes, lower back, upper back, right shoulder blade, left shoulder blade, back of the neck, back of the head, top of the head. Bring the awareness to the right leg, left leg, both legs together, front body, back body, the whole body together, the whole body together, your face, back of the head, upper body, lower body, the whole body, the whole body, become aware of the whole body, become aware of the whole body. Bring your awareness to your natural breath. Keep breathing at your pace. Do not change it. Become aware of your breath. Become aware of your inhale through the nose and exhale through the nose. Notice the sensation in the inhale. Inhale through the nostril, to the throat, to the lungs. Exhale from the bottom of the lungs, up to the throat. Breathe out through the nostril. Notice the sensation of nostril in the inhale. Notice the sensation of nostril in the exhale. Notice the temperature of the inhale. Your inhale is deep, deep into the lungs. Exhale from the bottommost of the lungs. Feel the temperature of the exhale. In your natural breath, bring the breath to your chest. Exhale, release. Inhale, bring the breath to the navel. Exhale, release. Inhale, Bring the breath to the right thigh. Exhale, release. 
Inhale, bring the breath to the left thigh. Exhale, release. Inhale, bring the breath to the right ankle. Exhale, release. Inhale, bring the breath to the left ankle. Exhale, release. Bring the breath to the hips. Exhale from the lower back. Come back to your natural breath. Visualize a cold mountain snowing. The cold mountain snowing. The wind blowing through your skin. The snowing wind blowing through your skin. Now sense your skin. Awaken the feeling of cold. The wind freezing your spine. You're experiencing cold. Awaken the experience of cold. Now come to the idea of heat. Imagine and visualize you are sitting near a fireplace. Imagine you are sitting near a fireplace. You can sense the heat. You can sense the heat from the fire. You can see the fire sparks. You sense the heat. The whole body experiencing the heat and warmth from the fire. Awaken the experience of heat. Bring the awareness to your body relaxing. Your body is relaxing on the ground. Your body is relaxing on the ground. Your body become heavier. Your body become heavier in every exhale. Feeling the gravity pulling your body. You can feel the gravity pulling your body. Your body become heavier. Your feet and ankles are heavy. Your legs are heavy. The hips are heavy. Your back is heavy.
Your palms are heavy. Your arms are heavy. Your shoulders are heavy. Your head and neck are heavy. Aware of your lips are heavy. Your eyes are heavy. The forehead is heavy. Your whole body is heavy. Now, feel the whole body becoming lighter. Your whole body become lighter and lighter. The head is light. The neck is light. The arms and hands are light. The hands becoming lighter to lift the four. The hands are off the floor. The right leg is light. The left leg is light. Both legs are light. Both legs are weightless. The whole body becoming weightless. You can feel the body is raising from the floor. You can feel the body is raising from the floor. You can feel the body is lift off the floor. Intensify your awareness. Bring your awareness to the middle of the eyebrow. Bring the awareness to the middle of the eyebrow. The dark space behind the eyebrow. Imagine an infinite ocean, very calm, very quiet. There is no sound in the ocean. There is a calm and quiet ocean. Try to discover a sound there. There is a sound, an infinite ocean, waves hitting the beach, seagull, crabs, some birds, snakes, living friendliness on the beach in harmony. You can hear the birds, the snakes, the crabs. And the waves. From the beach path leads to a cottage in the forest. There is a lonely cottage in the forest. A yogi is chanting Om. 
in a lotus pose. You can hear the sound Om. The chanting of Om over the infinite ocean. Become aware of your resource. The resource you made in the beginning of the practice. This is time to repeat your resource. Stage your resolve three times. In the same words, same attitude, mentally to yourself, with feeling and emphasis. Become aware of your breath. Become aware that you are breathing. Notice your natural breath. Breathing in through the nose. Breathing out through the nose. Become aware of your body laying. Become aware of your body laying. Gently move the hands. They are at ease and relax. Gently move the ankles. Move the feet. They are at ease and relax. Gently open and close the eyes. When your body is relaxed and ease in the well-being. You may stay here as long as you wish. The practice of yoga nidra is now complete.